Previously on Spinelli Speaks. Is it just me or does it feel like January was like months ago? Hi everyone, Danny here. Welcome back to my channel. Today is Thursday, which means it is time for a rapid review. And today I'm going to be doing a review of a book that I read with my book club. Today I'm going to be reviewing William Goldman's The Princess Bride. Now this title may be familiar because you may remember the film The Princess Bride, which is pretty much a cult classic. Now I read this with my book club and let me tell you, there were a lot of mixed reviews on this book. So I'm gonna try to do it justice in 60 seconds. Let's go ahead and start that timer. First things first, this is a metafiction, a story within a story. And many of my book club's mixed reviews came from the fact that it seems like this is an abridgment of an original classic fairy tale. It is not. This entire book is completely fictional. Goldman creates a character of himself to create this abridgment of a fairy tale, all fictional. It's also a parody, so it's meant to be funny. The story is mainly about Wesley and Buttercup. There are a ton of really great characters, like Inigo Montoya, Fezzik, Vincini, Prince Humperdinck, and Count Rugen, sure. It's a classic story of good versus evil in the pursuit of true love. William Goldman did write the screenplay for the movie, so it is very true to the novel. The one thing I really enjoyed about the book was the backstory of Nigo Montoya. His character was the most developed throughout the entire book. I would rate this four stars. It was pretty creative and I don't think you really see this all that often. All of that said, I would say that I probably like the movie more than the book. The book is great, but I think because I've seen the movie so many times, I've really just memorized so many scenes and the characters have just been ingrained into my heart and I just... I don't know. I feel like maybe if I had read the book first, I would probably like it a little bit more. Um, but the movie is just always going to be a classic in my eyes. Well, until next time, I hope you're all reading something great, taking care and staying safe. You know how it goes. Happy reading. Bye. Next time on Spinelli Speaks. Today we are going to be doing February's bullet journal.